Good morning, everybody. Today we will take a lesson about domain and kingdoms. Domains and kingdoms. What do you call an organism that is green, make its food, lives in bond water, and moves? Is it a plant or something in between? For hundreds of years, all living things were classified as a plant or animals. But over time, scientists discovered they did not fit easily into these two kingdoms. For example, species and organism of the genus Eglina, such as one shown in this figure, figure 1, has characteristics of both plants and animals. How would you classify such as an organism? What is it? Organisms are classified by their characteristics. For example, eaglenoids, which include members of the genus Eaglina, have the following characteristics. Number one, eaglenoids are single-celled and live in bond water. Number two, eaglenoids are green and make their own food by photosynthesis. These characteristics might lead you to conclude that eaglenoids are a plant. However, you should consider the following characteristics of eaglenoids. Eaglenoids move by whipping their tail, which is the characteristics of animal because animal move which are called flagella eaglenoids can feed on other organisms plants don't move around and usually don't eat other organisms so are eaglenoids animals as you can see eaglenoids don't fit into plants or animal categories. Scientists solve this classification problem by adding another kingdom. Another kingdom protested to classify organisms such as eaglenoids. As the scientists learn more about living things, they change the classification system. Today, there are three domains the classification system. Domains represent the largest difference between organisms. These domains are divided into several kingdoms. Here are there are a question. We can solve a question later. Biological classification scheme change depends on what? Depends on number A. As new evidence and more kingdom of organisms are discovered? Number B. Every hundred years? Number C. When scientists disagree? Number D. Only once. Please put your answer in the comment below and I will comment in your answer. Number four. Describe the characteristics of each of the three domains. Number five. Question number five. Describe the four kingdom of domain of Eukarya. This is a domain Archaea. This is the domain Archaea. This is a place in the American Grand Prismatic spring in a Yellowstone National Park contains water that is about 90 degree, very hot, extreme environment. The spring is home, this is spring, is home to Archaea. So Archaea can live in extreme environment. To Archaea that thrive into its hot water. Thank you.